um, ways for people to have to be able to, to learn how to paint. It's good to have you in the show yeah, today. Thank you. And you, you know, a lot of people have, have seen your work and they've loved you for years. And a lot of people have, you know, have been on board with this for a long time. Some people have never tried it before. I know, and I'm excited about you guys well, you, out there. What Donna's <laughs> done is she created a kit for all of you out there that, you know, maybe first timers or people that didn't think you could ever paint. It's called our uh, One Stroke Foundation Beginner's Kit. It's everything you need to get started. You get the templates, you get the paints, you get the stencils, brushes, practice sheets, you get Donna's Amazing Method, everything that you would need in a stress-free and easy way to learn how to paint. And I always get so excited watching you do this <laughs> because I, like, I've, never, I've never really gotten into painting, you know, but when right. I watch you, I'm like, you know I what? I can make you a believer. You could totally make me a believer. <laughs> so let's talk about the kit. Okay, guys, I want you to know that you can learn how to paint. Have you ever even imagined that you could paint something like this? Gorgeous. This is for a beginner. I want you to see that laying out these flowers and these leaves make it really easy and possible for everybody with my kit. This is a beginner and it's got foundation templates in it, yep. but it's a beginner kit. And I have to tell you, it's exclusive here because people go, oh, Donna, give me that kit. I can't, it's right here. I can give it to you right here. That's the, that's the magic. So I want to show you a couple of little magic steps yeah, for yeah, this. Yeah. All right, so these are all laminated and I have two 11 by 17s in here. So this is your floral composition guide. Okay. So you can, first of all, turn right here and decide what kind of composition. And as you saw, there's all kinds of surfaces. So here's a border. We have arches and we have L's. Can you see the L? Oh, yeah. And the heart and just round, a round bouquet, and then bouquets that are held by a ribbon, yeah. swags, everything you need. Now, I want you to see these little gray layouts or these templates I'm gonna show you in just a minute, but I want you to, to look at this and decide, okay, which of these do you want? So pick a design. Right, pick a yep. design. Come over here, pick which flowers or, you know, flower flowers. Uh -huh. Pick your leaves, pick your fillers, and then pick your, your insects. All right, so now what happens is then I give you all the paint to paint on any of those surfaces, glass, ceramic, metal, wood, anything you can imagine right here, indoor, outdoor, because it has a sealer inside. So you need one type of paint and you have 10 of those. You have the floating medium that people keep saying, what is that you're going into? And then you have five templates and these are foundation templates so that you can take Learn and practice these flowers, but then if you go to and start painting them, you're going, oh no, mine is really big and my leaf doesn't fit. Right. So I'm going to teach you in this program how easy it is to lay out what I just showed you right here. Hey, really quick, uh, Donna, let me remind everybody that we took $7 off. This is on sale today. Ooh, if you have always great. wanted to paint, maybe you recently retired or maybe, uh, you know, you've, you've lost a loved one and you're trying to figure out how to, how to have a soothing way to relax and enjoy and get over something like that. Or maybe yeah. your kid, like me, my, you know, my son's going away to college in a couple of days and I'm looking for a way to really kind of take my mind off things. This is the way to do it. Flex pay means only $10.74. This, this could open up a whole world for you. I know, and I'm telling you, this makes it magic for you, I yeah. promise you. Now look, I did these templates, and let's okay. pick out the flower. We picked out rose, for instance, or open rose, because it's easy. You get three sizes of every type of flower. Okay. And, and daisies and all there also. So I've decided I'm gonna put the medium size of this flower, and what really helps you guys is that you can use the color of whatever you want it to be. So I'm gonna do the, the rose, yeah. so I just take my brush and just ghost it. Okay, okay do you so know what just, that means? So you just see it. lightly brush it. Right, and okay. I can even put a bud over here, like a couple buds if uh, I want, rose just buds. Just using this little template. Yeah, so you just lay that out there. Then there's these five little flowers here. Now I can change that to lavender so that I have a lavender color so you'll know, okay, that's where those are gonna go. And so I'm gonna sit here and I put my stem first, did y'all see that? So I'm going to come here and just do a cluster of these little lavenders. Yeah. So, so I've laid that out from what I've seen in sure. my, my design, remember this? Yeah. All right, so then the cool thing here is we're gonna take the leaves, and this is where a lot of people go, I have no idea where to put those. Right. Now there's three sizes, so I'm gonna come here and see this fern? You can ghost this fern on here, uh -huh. and guess what? Some of that you can just leave and you have fern. You don't yeah. even have to do more painting. Right. So now if you're out there and you thought, oh, I would love to be able to do this, 
I always have a hard time laying it out. I've given you the easy way to lay it out. Doesn't that look easy? Oh my gosh. All right, so then. And I love is that as you're using the paint, you're getting different shading there because it's, it's draining some from the brush. Yeah, look see at that? This. Okay, so now I want you to see really quick that I've already made this ready for you. Wow. Okay, so you see how easy that was and to lay nothing, it out. Nothing complicated right, there, right? Right, and so I know which things you're gonna use the most. I have five templates full of designs for you, right? So then I'm gonna show you that we're gonna take and we're gonna load these two colors and we can come right in here and fill in these fern. Can they see that? Yeah. All yeah. right, so you can leave some of them and not have them restroked, but what's gonna happen is after you practice, look, I have this guide that you're gonna go to right here, reusable, reusable. You're gonna come right here, you're gonna practice on here, guy, and then what they do is they wipe this off and practice again. And that shows you the stroke. That and how shows to hold you the, the pressure, stroke. Right? So I've, yeah. isn't that great? So along with, I've got the template to make it easy. I have the reusable teaching guide to practice. Yeah. And then you're gonna come here and just do your strokes. And this okay? Donna is one of those things when you learn your method, you pick up on it really quickly. Exactly. Like how to, how to use, how to make those other things. Cause I've watched you before and I know a lot of people that use your method right. and they're like, oh my gosh, you pick it up really quick. And all of a sudden you're like, I never knew I could do that. And you have the teacher at home with you. So let me yeah. show you, I'm gonna, you, <laughs> I give you the three brushes. You're gonna get a three quarter for the bigger. You're gonna get the 12, which is what I'm using. And you're gonna get an eight. So you get every size that matches my templates. And okay. see how quick that rose is? So then we're gonna come in here. I would use it's my the, favorite part, how you how you load the brush and you've got two different colors of paint on there, but yeah. it's not that complicated. Yeah, I've got double loaders yeah. and those double loaders help you to be able to work out the colors so Look you don't it. have mud. Look at this. And then oh. we just pounce some color in the middle. I should have used a bigger brush because then that would have been faster. Yeah, all, right? all right. But right? look what happens. Look at Look what happens. Just Can that you simple. See what we just did? So let me tell you, it is possible for any of you to create all these beautiful things over here. And I give you the tin paints, the floating medium, the three brushes. Yeah. I give you the composition, design, layout, and I give yeah. you everything so that you can start right away at home. It's like the teacher's with you. Yeah. My exact strokes are with you and it helps you to be able to do a border and, and to do I glass, metal, okay. ceramic, fabric, everything you can imagine. You know what's amazing about what you do is all, and all these things that, we, that you've purchased here to paint on, are a dollar, two dollars. Yes. I mean, you didn't spend a time. You can go to any store and get a blank canvas pillow for a couple of dollars. Yes. And you can turn it into a pillow that's worth $75. I mean, or and, whatever you value your and own. And a handmade at. personal gift. And I yes. tell you, I have seven children. I sat at my dining room table and created my technique and created ways that I could paint easy because I didn't have a teacher to teach me. No. And I looked at things and I thought, I want a pretty house. How can I make that happen? Right. And I want you to see that just making a simple daisy, you can make this all daisies in the beginning. Look at this. Now you're gonna learn these little simple strokes. And look, I use the handle of my brush <laughs> and I dot the center. And in a few minutes, I'm gonna do lots more painting flowers for you. So I want you to see that if, even the dragonfly, if we come here and we do a really light green with white to do this dragonfly, Look how fun this is. Yeah, well, you know what? I love that you hold everybody's hand through this, too, <laughs> through the process, because I know I think the biggest blockade, Donna, for people is they just flat out say, I'm not, I can't do that. Yeah. She's an artist. And Let even when you practice my strokes, they go, yeah. oh, yes, but like my leaves don't look that. Where do I put that leaf? Where do I put that flower? Yeah. So if you've done a, a flower and then, then the leaf ruins everything because you don't know the size, I have three sizes for each one. I have a brush to fit each one of those. I have the magic is yeah. these templates that are nowhere else but here. And I want you to know these foundation templates give you long leaves, big daisies to small daisies. It gives you all the shapes of roses and open flowers and the ferns. This one right here will be your favorite. Now I made them yeah. so you could perforate it and cut them or you can keep it together like I did and just lay it out. And so you guys are so organized. I know you'll find that easy. Dragonfly, bumblebees, butterflies, I and love more. It. You know, and it's and I'm glad you chose this medium because when people start, this is something they love to do. They love to do flowers and they love to do little creatures and bees. Yes. And, and those are so colorful it too. It finishes. So, and you know what? For what you would pay for this kit, if you made one pretty painting,